check out this 10 week roadmap from data analyst to data engineer. Hey guys, I created a 10 week roadmap for you. If you're coming from a data analyst position and you want to get into data engineering, then these are the topics you actually have to focus on to get that data engineering job. So go to learndataengineering.com and in the beginner section, I have a bunch of roadmaps and here's your 10 weeks step-by-step -step roadmap. Week one, look into Python for data engineers, how we use Python and how we process data with Python. Then look into platform and pipeline design, which is something important. You need to know which tools are around uh, that we're using and what is a data platform and what are some pipelines that you usually see. Then depending on what you have done already, relational or dimensional data modeling, take a week around this because um, for these, for all of you who have worked with uh, data warehouses, dimensional modeling should be super easy and then look into relational or the other way around. If you're already worked with a relational database, then look into dimensional modeling. Afterwards, week five, now you can, uh, when you have only done one here, you can do this in two weeks. Look into Docker fundamentals. It's always important to run Docker. You understand how to deploy code with Docker or run fully tools on Docker. And then learn, get into APIs, learn how to use APIs and how to set up APIs yourself. And with that knowledge, I highly recommend to take two weeks for a full end-to-end -end project. For instance, on AWS, on Azure or GCP, any cloud, it doesn't really matter. You should look into what's uh, hip or what's needed in your area and in your, in your uh, industry. Then as an analyst, you already understand um, working with large amounts of data, working with um, dimensional databases very often or data warehouses. Look into Snowflake. Snowflake is used a lot and transforming data with dbt in snowflake that is a really really cool combination strong combination and then at week 10 pipeline orchestration with airflow i think these are the the topics that you need as a data analyst and these will deliver you great results i have done this with hundreds of students i have a lot of people in my coaching program where i support them for six months this is the way how to make that jump from data analyst to data engineer, where it will actually save you a lot of time instead of jumping around endlessly. These are the things that you need. It's quick to learn, 10 weeks and you're there. Also only this week, 20% off with the code ROADMAPS2025. LearnDataEngineering.com